conference vibe. After almost 30,000 steps, including some 500 minutes of standing, two Vegas loop rides, 61 video segments, including two live streams, and 140 minutes of content, our coverage of Apex, Automotive Aftermarket Products Expo, and SEMA, Specialty Equipment Market Association Show, closes. Apex and SEMA consistently attract over 161 thousand to Las Vegas, including over 70,000 buyers and 3,300 media and 2,400 exhibiting companies from 140 countries. The event leverages 1.2 million net square feet of exhibit space and an additional 1 million square feet outside of the Las Vegas Convention Center in neighboring areas, including the West Gate. Featuring over 1,500 vehicles in booths and throughout the convention center and over 3,000 new products, it is the place to be for those in the automotive sector. The combined events feature live presentations, interactive demos, training, education, and networking within the global automotive industry. Apex leverage the full Venetian Expo lower hall. The entire upper hall including leveraging the rooms for meetings and sessions. The usual Venetian eateries were available, including the cafe, the food marketplace, and the bistro. In addition, Apex always features the truck stop downstairs and a beer garden near the bridge over to Caesars Forum. Admittedly, it's the only time I noticed the immovable temporary eateries being named something reflecting the nature of the event itself. Apex also formally leverages all of Caesar's Forum for exhibits. For getting around those wishing to zip from Apex over to SEMA, Caesar's Forum has a monorail station one can leverage. Buses also ran between all Apex and SEMA locations within SEMA. The West Hall and North Hall are connected via a connecting corridor that hosted the legendary SEMA Art Walk. One can also take the Vegas Loop from South Hall, Central Hall, or West Halls to get to each other or the connected hotels. SEMA spanned the entirety of the Las Vegas Convention Center, since the new Central Lobby still under construction. TBW Advisors LLC was able to get a sneak peek of its upcoming grandeur. It's valuable to note that many vendors had multiple booths at both events. Even multiple booths in the same event. While in 2019, the event wasn't sure what a technologist and data expert would do at Apex and SEMA, this year, just as last, featured more and more technology for us to dig into, especially in North Hall. North Hall was dedicated to first-time exhibitors, business services, and mobile electronics and technology. We were able to capture the healthy eatery in North Hall while we were there. South Hall Lower featured the tire expo as well as wheels and accessories. South Hall Upper featured collision repair and refinishing both equipment and tools to execute. Central Hall featured racing, performance, power sports, utility vehicles, and the entire restoration marketplace. West Hall features all the specialty recreating trucks, SUVs, and off-roads. Specialty equipment, including accessories. As is customary, we also caught the food available in West Hall. SEMA is also very well known for the SEMA show outdoor exhibition of cars. Enjoy our walkabout. We once again live stream from on site on Tuesday from Apex requesting those attending to find me to answer questions one through three and Wednesday from SEMA show to request assistance on your favorite videos for my segment on November 8th broadcast edition of Computer Talk Radio. While at Apex and SEMA 2025 we conducted research for three additional forthcoming whisper reports. Question 1. Whisper Report. What retrofit risk will stall EV adoption 
in 2026. WISP report. What AI tool will disrupt diagnostics first? And WISP report. What tech blind spot will stall aftermarket innovation in 2026? We once again had question four. What's the best part about attending Apex and SEMA live in Vegas 2025? Readers and viewers wishing to experience, or should we say re-experience, the entire event are encouraged to watch the entire Conference Whispers Apex SEMA playlist in its entirety. The video edition will conclude with a montage of responses to question four. What's the best part about attending Apex and SEMA live in Las Vegas? capturing the energy and moments that made the event completely unforgettable. Welcome to Conference Whispers, Apex and SEMA 2025 Video Edition. I'm Dr. Doreen Galley, Chief of Research at TBW Advisors, LLC. The answer is always in the whispers. Exhibits. Touring the exhibits we captured, we will start with the technology to help auto shop owners be found online in the first place. Auto shop solutions. Need to get your technicians certified? AV Tech is not just talking about certifications. They help to ensure your team has the right qualifications to meet your customer needs. Hunter Engineering was on hand with their portfolio of solutions. Their focus is making life easier for technicians, more profitable for owners, leading to happier and customers to get the word out. Boasting over 50,000 customers worldwide in 35 countries, Clipboard provides solutions from point of sale through inventory management, e-commerce, and catalog, including all data for tire and service companies. If you are seeking diagnostics, for anything from automotive, heavy duty truck, all highway equipment, marine and power sports, you are in luck. Texa revealed their five in one diagnostic solution, including demonstrations in their bay at Joe's Garage. If the challenge in your shop is diagnosing and calibrating ADOS, the advanced driver assisted systems, equipped vehicles, Opus IVS wants their intelligent vehicle support solution on your radar. Opus IVS is literally an entire ecosystem for the automotive aftermarket for diagnosing, calibrating ADOS equipped vehicles. Instead of going to an auto shop, perhaps your dream of an auto shop coming to you? Perhaps even insisting they bring OEM equipment? Then Elitech is making your dreams come true. If it isn't necessarily about repair, but a complete rebuild, even rebuilding heavy trucks, LKQ has a solution to fit your needs. They can even help create parts no longer available. Have a big truck and want to avoid accidents, or more specifically, remove your blind spots. Vox was very excited to share their revolutionary aftermarket product with you. Perhaps it is not so much about blind spots, but about recording what's going on around your vehicle. Worried about the solution failing over putting a huge drain on your battery? Having a hard time finding one with decent resolution, or better yet, one with built-in privacy so you can share your videos online, and technology to clean up the plate's imaging for accountability? One of the stars from our CES coverage, Voidride, was back at SEMA with their high-res, never-fail dash cam. Perhaps one is seeking a fast car. Turntide was in Central Hall with their axial flux motor in an all-electric Sierra Echo S able to reach top speed of 140 miles an hour. Electric vehicles on your mind, but you're more concerned with replacing your EV battery on your car in your garage? Green Tech has 35 locations across the U.S. and includes recycling capabilities. More of a traditional, no replacement for displacement, combustion motors fan, but find the ECU getting in the way of your performance dreams? AutoTune bought their solution to assist you with over 21,000 different cars. Finally, 
as denoted, many technology companies were there to support the general business functions, including Linco with their global logistics solution. Linco proudly shared that they can help you optimize your entire supply chain globally. Next year's conference. SEMA will once again return to Las Vegas November 3rd through November 6, 2026. SEMA returns to the Las Vegas Convention Center. APEX 2026 will be held November 3rd through November 5th, 2026 at the Venetian Expo, with some educational events commencing as early as November 1st. Read the full report, now available online. Join the conversation and subscribe today. This has been Conference Whispers Apex and SEMA 2025 Video Edition. Thank you to all those that contributed to our research. Thinking about joining us next year? The answer is always in the whispers. Have an amazing day. I'm Lance Lasinski. I'm with Medtronics, and I think my favorite part about attending this show is being able to meet with all the key customers and key people um, and have those conversations that you need to have all in one place. Again, Frank Turlop, Opus IVS, and the best, first of all, this is my 40th year at either NACE and SEMA, so I must love it because I'm here 40 years. Uh, one of the best things about SEMA is, number one, you get to, you get to see a lot of your compadres. Number two, you get to see the new cool stuff, right? And number three, you get to present our cool new stuff to the, to the people in the market. All right, so I'm Joshua at Green Tech Auto. Um, the best part about being here at SEMA is the networking. Not only that, but I get to see lots of cool cars that I don't ever get to see. I wish my daddy was here. This is exactly what he wants to see, what he wants. Um, and concepts. I like to see concept vehicles. I got flying cars in here. I got old Shelbys. I got, I got everything you could want. I'm Jason Glass from Turn Tide, and man, SEMA this year is fantastic. Seeing all my best friends, seeing all my customers, it's the best part about SEMA. So I'm Benjamin from Auto Tuner, and the best part at SEMA is to meet all our users and the future users. Thank you. Hi, I'm Dan, I'm with Vox, and the best part of SEMA in Vegas is getting to meet new people from all over the world. John Fisher, and I am with Clipboard. I'm the Vice President of Sales and Marketing with Clipboard, and we're just, we're so excited to be here in Vegas, and I'm just excited to see our customers and to meet, meet new prospects that are here. My name is Justin Allen with Hunter Engineering Company, and the best part about coming to Apex here in Vegas is the people and the opportunities that you have to connect with other enthusiastic, encouraging members of our automotive industry. Hi, Fabio Mazzon, Technical Manager with Texa USA. It's always good to be here at Apex and see my meet uh, our customer, our dealer, and new customers. Hi, my name is Brian Luke. I'm with Auto Shop Solutions, and the best part of uh, attending Apex and SEMA is seeing where the industry is going and all of the new innovations that we have coming down the pipe. I'm working at Euroid, and we are participating in SEMA 2025 in Las Vegas. Andrew Yokel, Linco. Best part about coming to CPEC, uh, Apex or SEMA is meeting new people and hearing about what they're doing in the industry and how it's transversing, not just the automotive world. John Amato, I'm with Autel, and the best part of attending Apex SEMA is learning about all of the new products that are out there, all the new innovations, and of course we get to spend time with a lot of our customers and share with them all the new things that we're working on. Tech Vehicle Services, we are the services side of the Greater OKQ Corporation. The best thing about attending Apex and SEMA is the interaction with the people from all over the world, created to see the newest technology, and of course on the SEMA side, latest, greatest builds, custom cars, and again, interaction with the fine people that attend. So I'm Larry Reeves, I'm with LKQ Heavy Truck. And the best part has just been all of the people that have been here. We, uh, we're kind of introducing the heavy truck side of things, so there's lots of opportunity here, so it's been a great show.